So I'll uh, present our part in this uh, effort to bring the 2D reflective waveguides with the 3D printed uh, prescription uh, lenses by LuxXL. Lumus, what we do, we do optical engines. Optical engines are these near to eye display devices. They have a waveguide combiner. They have a micro projector that generates the virtual image and injects the image into the combiner. And these are actually the devices that enable AR. These are the devices that can uh, bring to the user's view a virtual image overlaid on the uh, real world scene. And th this is what we do. We do optical engine. We're an optical engines company. We are early entrant to this industry. We have invented reflective waveguide technology many years ago. Our business model is a licensing business model. We license either off-the-shelf designs or custom designs that we do for companies to our manufacturing partners who then are able to uh, manufacture that in scale. Again, we're an early entrant. Uh, we have already shipped more than 3,000 of these uh, optical engine devices. We have generated over the years more than $100 million. We do have a presence uh, both in the military and the uh, medical markets, as well as other enterprise market, not consumer uh, as of yet. We have a very unique and strong intellectual property position. We have more than 113 patent families, and we're continuing to innovate and rely on a very strong world-class R&D team that continues to innovate and uh, produce new innovations to make these devices better, higher performance, smaller form factor. And we're making big progress over the years. Again, we're a licensing company and we are ready to mass manufacture through ODM partners or manufacturing partners, uh, SHOT and Quanta. A little bit about the technology. So this is a single slide showing an optical engine. So we have here a micro projector. It has a micro display that generates the virtual image and some collimating light optics that collimates the light into an entrance aperture of the waveguide. The waveguide is a 2D expansion replication device. So it replicates the pupil in both dimensions. And uh, you see here, eventually the outcoupler projects this image to the uh, user's eye box or into the eye. This is already second generation of our uh, 2D uh, expansion devices. But what we'll show here is the work we did on the first generation, the Maximus, the work we did with LuxXL. Another slide presenting our very unique uh, position in terms of uh, intellectual property and our unique position in the industry. So uh, what uh, this uh, clip that I'll, uh, I'll start in a minute shows is the citation count of Lumus patents in patents of other selected SIMEs in the industry. You see here all the big names. And you can see that uh, as it progressed over the years. So we're starting from 2010 and we see more and more and more citation. And this is accelerating as the industry is maturing and again, presenting a very dominant position uh, in the market and it's accelerated uh, dominance uh, as we come to, to today, to 2022. Some of the key advantages of our technology uh, usability advantages, very long battery lifetime due to very high luminance efficiency of the technology. In practice, this is probably the only waveguide that is uh, suitable for outdoor use that can generate enough nits to the eye in the outdoors. And you do need multiple thousands of nits to the eye in a bright sunny day. And another nice feature is the reduced uh, forward light leakage uh, that is uh, inherent to some of the uh, diffractive or, or holographic technologies. We do have highest image quality, highest resolution, and very good uh, color uniformity 
some of the issues that some of our competitors are uh, struggling with. This is another uh, slide. We talked a little bit about performance and image quality, but this one highlights the form factor, the size and weight, big uh, progress that was done in uh, recent years. We have here uh, OE50. This is one of our legacy 1D optical engines. We sold many, many, many thousands of this. And this is the Maximus, our 2D expansion waveguide. And we see that not only that the contrast, brightness, image quality are superior, but also in terms of size, form factor, weight, multiple uh, form factor parameters that are listed here in these two columns, there's huge advantages for the uh, 2D expansion waveguide uh, devices over the ones or the legacy uh, 1D uh, waveguide devices that uh, we have been making for many years. And now to the work we have done with, uh, with LuxXL. We took this uh, Maximus, the 2D uh, waveguide expansion Maximus device. We have sent the waveguide to LuxXL. They have 3D printed push-pull lenses uh, on both sides, sent it back to us. And uh, what you see here on the left is the encapsulated waveguide with these uh, push-pull lenses that we got back from LuxXL. Next to it, you see the uh, micro projector. And here it is. All what we did is we bonded the micro projector together with the encapsulated waveguide. And we have a Maximus device with all its uh, nice and uh, good uh, performance characteristics. Now also integrated with the RX lenses solution. And in the next slide, what we will show is the small clip we took in the lab. This is the encapsulated waveguide, the Maximus optical engine. And this is the image for the uh, LuxXL integrated waveguide. So we're retaining all the good characteristics of the Maximus, but now uh, integrated with an RX solution.